Sheila Battles will be representing the MPP in the Ablekuma North constituency in the 2020 parliamentary elections after she won the party's primaries on Saturday. She managed to upset the incumbent, Nani Friyopoku, by a difference of 203 votes. The other aspirants, Kojo Bewa and John Agbote, polled 315, 88 and 20 votes respectively. Of the 945 delegates who expected to cast their ballot, 941 took part in the process. Prior to the commencement of the polls, all aspirants, with the exception of the incumbent, Nani Kuefriye, were locked in a meeting at the party's constituency office over disagreements with regards to the voter album. I reached out to the office to try to work with them on clarifying some of the issues concerning our constituency register. Mm. And the, the region has worked very hard with us to go through various processes to come to a conclusion as to which of the police station executives or delegates should be voting. And it's unfortunate because of all of the, these issues we have experienced, it took a very long time for them to compile our register. In actual fact, they had been working all night, so we only saw the register this morning. Um, and obviously, there were still a few issues that we realized in there. So we have raised it with the national executives who have come to support us. And they have looked at it, and I believe that we have come to a logical conclusion. You know, we, we, we had a problem with the album, the delegate's album, so to say. We had a problem with it, and then we spent time trying to resolve it. Now, at the end of it, the decisions we made at the meeting, we left it in the hands of the regional executives to implement. Implement in the sense that those who are supposed to be removed, we agreed to be, to be removed should be removed and then those we agreed to be maintained be maintained other party delegates also accused the incumbent mp nani kui of scheming with some constituency executives to rig the election there were allegations of vote buying aspirants who were seen giving out envelopes yes. as for the album mm. we knew the constituency chairman and executives are supposed to bring the right album mm. but uh, as of now mm. the executive committee has not brought including the uh, current mp the incumbent mm. So we are pointing our finger to the incumbent MP and the constituent executive. Mm. They should do the right thing. Mm. If they knew those who are here, they are not supposed to vote. We will not allow them. We did hear that uh, one of the other aspirants is um, participating in that. Do you kind know of that aspirant? I do, but um, I, care, I don't care to mention it. But um, I believe that um, when you have a good message and um, you know what exactly it is that you are presenting to people will sell. There is no need to try to entice them with money. Even before the results were officially declared, supporters of Sheila Battelle's poured out to the streets in wild jubilations in clear defiance of all COVID-19 protocols. Sheila Battelle's won six out of the seven electoral centers in the constituency and she thanked the delegates for their support and pledged to work to increase the party's vote margin in the national election. <laughs>